द क्वेश्चन इज फ्रॉम द फॉलोइंग ट्रायल बैलेंस एक्सट्रैक्टेड फ्रॉम द बुक्स ऑफ ए प्रिपेयर ट्रेडिंग एंड प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट फॉर द ईयर एंडिंग थर्टी फर्स्ट मार्च टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन एंड बैलेंस शीट आज एट दैट डेट द ट्रायल बैलेंस इज गिवेन एंड द एडजस्टमेंट्स आर गिवेन नाउ वी शुड स्टार्ट विथ वी हैव टू ड्रॉ द ट्रेडिंग एंड प्रॉफिट एंड लॉस अकाउंट इन द बुक्स ऑफ ए फॉर द ईयर एंडेड थर्टी फर्स्ट मार्च टू थाउजेंड सिक्सटीन आफ्टर दैट वी हैव टू राइट डाउन इन द क्रेडिट साइड बाई सेल्स रुपीज फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड फोर हंड्रेड फिफ्टी लेस सेल्स रिटर्न रुपीज टू हंड्रेड इन द फाइनल कलम वी विल हैव रुपीज फिफ्टीन थाउजेंड टू हंड्रेड फिफ्टी then by closing stock rupees 3250 closing stock is an adjustment it will be shown under the head current assets in the asset side of the balance sheet then come down to debit side to opening stock that is rupees 3460 then to purchases rupees 5475 less purchases return that is rupees 125 In the final column, we will have rupees five three five zero. Then the credit side total will be rupees eighteen thousand five hundred. We have to write it in the debit side, and then we will be finding out to gross profit carried down that is rupees nine six nine zero. Next is your profit and loss account by gross profit brought down that is rupees nine six nine zero. Then By commission, we are getting commission. Commission is credit rupees three hundred seventy-five. Then to salaries rupees thirty-three hundred, three thousand three hundred in the inside column, and we have one outstanding salary as per adjustment number three. Rupees salaries rupees three hundred and taxes rupees hundred twenty. Are outstanding. Hence, to salaries rupees thirty three hundred. Add outstanding salary that is rupees three hundred. In the final column, we will have rupees thirty six hundred. Next one is our two insurance and taxes. And in the same adjustment, I have just read rupees hundred twenty taxes also outstanding. Add outstanding taxes and less prepaid insurance. Fourth adjustment: insurance amounting to rupees hundred is prepaid. Less prepaid insurance hundred. Add outstanding taxes rupees hundred twenty. In the final column, we will have rupees twelve hundred seventy. And uh, the next one being to bad debts rupees hundred twenty five, given in the debit side of the debit column of the trial balance, and. Adjustment five, right of a further rupees hundred as bad debts. Further rupees hundred. Add further bad debt, bad debts that is rupees hundred. And after that, in this adjustment, it is also written in the fifth point. And provision for doubtful debt is to be made equal to five percent on sundry debtors. Now. This hundred is to be deducted from the debt from the debtors given in the trial balance, and whatever will be remaining there, its five percent will be new provision for bad debts. Hence, after deducting hundred from the debtors, we have to calculate five percent on that. That is rupees hundred eighty five, and we have to add uh, all these three. That is coming to be rupees four hundred ten. Out of this provision for bad debts given in the trial balance credit side will be deducted. Will be deducted from this four hundred ten that is rupees two hundred, and will be showing in the final column that is rupees two hundred ten. Here how this one hundred eighty five was calculated is given there. Debtors are rupees thirty eight hundred. Out of this rupees hundred bad debt further bad debt is to be deducted. Then this thirty seven hundred into seven into five percent will be rupees one hundred eighty five. Then 
the next one is to stationary 450 rupees c adjustment 6 half of the stationary was used by a for his personal purposes hence stationary drawing is that there we bought stationary for the business for rupees 450 rupees that is an official expenditure but out of that 50% is withdrawn by the old stationer 50% of stationery used by the proprietor for his private purpose less drawings that is rupees 225 after that we will be showing in the final column rupees 225 then to depreciation building rupees 375 it is given building 5% 5% on building value is rupees 375 And furniture is ten percent. That is six hundred forty into ten percent for furniture. That is rupees sixty four. And then loose tools. That is were revalued at five thousand. See in the debit debit column of the trial balance. It is given loose tools. That is rupees one two five zero. That is six two five zero. And it is now revalued at five thousand. Previously, the loose tools was appearing at six to five zero. Now it is revalued at the end of the year at five thousand. Hence, loss and loose tools is rupees one two five zero. After that, we have to show it in the final column. That is one rupees one six eight nine. Next one is your interest. Interest paid. Interest charged by from us by other companies. It is given to be uh, interest rupees one hundred eighteen. Next is your general expenses or business expenses that is rupees seven hundred eighty two, and the credit side totaling is rupees ten thousand zero six five. And write it down in the debit side and deduct all the profit and loss account expenditures to find out net profit. That is two net profit carried down. That is rupees two one seven one. This is our uh, next one is your balance sheet. Balance sheet of a as at thirty first March two thousand sixteen. Start from the asset side. That is current assets, cash in hand rupees six hundred fifty. The next one is your prepaid insurance being an adjustment in rupees hundred. Next one is hundred debtors rupees three thousand eight hundred less. Further bad debts rupees hundred given in the adjustment. Then whatever is there that is uh, that is rupees three seven zero zero. Its five percent will be one hundred eighty five rupees. Hence less new provision for bad debt rupees one hundred eighty five. Then after deducting this, we will be showing it in the final column that is rupees three five one five. Next year is. Closing stock. Next item is that is rupees three two five zero. Next is your loose tools that is rupees six two five zero and revalued at five thousand. That is less depreciation rupees one two five zero. After that, loose tools will be rupees five thousand. It was the previous value of loose tools is rupees six two five zero and it is now revalued at five thousand. Hence the de difference is depreciation. Next one is fixed assets. Here building rupees seventy five hundred less depreciation ten percent rupees three hundred seventy five. And the final column it will be rupees seven one two five. And the next day it will be furniture rupees. Furniture given in the trial balance that is furniture is equal to sixty four. Then in the final column we can show you how this five five hundred seventy six. That is net of furniture after depreciation, and then the balance will be totaling will be rupees twenty thousand two hundred sixteen. This is the uh, totaling of the asset side. Then come down to the liability side. The current liabilities first item being sundry creditors, that is rupees two five double zero. Then outstanding salary that is rupees three hundred being an adjustment shown in the liability sides. Current assets. Then next one is your uh, outstanding taxes rupees hundred twenty. Then the next one is bank overdraft rupees two eight five zero. Then long term liabilities and capital that is five 
फर्स्ट वन इज कैपिटल रुपीज वन टूल थाउजेंड फाइव हंड्रेड देन आर नेट प्रॉफिट दैट इज रुपीज सेवन टू टू वन सेवन वन देन नेक्स्ट वन इज दैट इज लेस स्टेशनरी ड्रॉइंग्स एज यू हैव सोन इन द प्रॉफिट एंड लेस अकाउंट समबडी इज ड्रॉइंग कैश समबडी इज ड्रॉइंग गुड्स एंड स्टेशनरी ड्रॉइंग्स अकाउंट डेबिटेड इज टू बी डिडक्टेड फ्रॉम द नेट प्रॉफिट इन द बैलेंस शीट नेक्स्ट वन इज टोटलिंग दैट इज फोर्टीन थाउजेंड फोर फोर सिक्स एंड टोटल दिस बोथ लाइबिलिटीज एंड एसेट्स एसेट्स हैज ऑलरेडी बीन टोटल एंड नाउ द टर्न ऑफ लाइबिलिटीज दैट इज ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड टू वन सिक्स दिस इज द फाइनल आंसर हियर दिस ट्वेंटी थाउजेंड टू वन सेवन माइनस फोर फोर ट्रिपल फोर सिक्स शुड नॉट बी देयर एंड दिस इज ऑल अबाउट योर आंसर